Hey, uh, talk to you about this chipper real quick. Uh, Wilbur's chipper overheated, and uh, I think I know why. The uh, in, inside the the housing here, there's two. Hope you can see this. There's two uh, heat exchangers. One of them is the intercooler, the aluminum one, as the intercooler for the you know the the air charge going into the engine, and the the copper one over here is uh, the black one is a radiator for the engine coolant and this thing was just super clogged uh really really thick um i've pressure washed it for probably an hour and a half and uh a lot of junk came out i feel feeling it's still full but uh not full i have a feeling there's still things in there but uh i, I could I, I was spraying and spraying and spraying and, and no more black water and, and junk was coming out of it so i'm going to give it back to him now and hopefully he can chip a little bit today and see if that worked uh, a good indication we, we probably need to both set up a protocol process for cleaning the radiator and a, a, a regime or an interval by which they get cleaned before they overheat uh, I noticed afterwards when I started it up uh, it was running cool 175 degrees which is I, I think that's well below you know the maximum of course I wasn't putting anything through it so it wasn't straining but uh, if you put your hand right here over in the radiator, the, the airflow is, is this way, out from the engine, and it blows this way. So that's good. It should, you know, force some of the debris. But, of course, you have debris flying up into the, in here and going through the radiator, getting stuck. But uh, the, uh, an indication that it's, it's flowing well is that when you stand right here, there's a significant amount of air blowing in your face. And I can, you can, I can move my hand up and down and I can feel differences in, in the air movement. So that tells me it's still clogged a little bit. Uh, probably a lot of our chippers are clogged. We need to run through all of them before you know we get into 90 degree temperatures in a couple of weeks. So uh, probably start cycling them out and uh, power wash them. You, you get filthy doing it. Uh, probably wanna wear um, uh, rain gear or something. Uh, Cause I got super disgusting. So. Anyway, that's that's what's up with the radiators.